Hello, Todd Murray with Dell Tech Center here. This is a quick video demo on how to use Microsoft Excel 2007 to create a graph of the data from the PowerVault MD3000i. So, whenever you use the command line for the MD3000i, it's possible to have it output a CSV file of the performance data. So here, if we open up that CSV file in, uh, in Excel 2007, this is what you see. So you've got uh, some uh, basic performance stats. Let's use the freeze panes here to freeze the top row so we can always see what the columns are. Then I'm just going to do some adjustment here to get where we can read it more uh, clearly. Uh, so basically you get, uh, based on the number of iterations, you'll get a set of data for these things that you see here, total IOs, read percentage, cache hit, current kilobytes per second, maximum kilobytes per second, current IOs per second, and maximum IOs per second. Um, and it does it for the entire race. You'll see um, controllers and uh, virtual disk. So first let's select the first column, and then we're going to select, I mean sort on a custom sort, and it's going to select all of the data. We're going to sort by column A. So what that will do is it'll sort all the things in the first item. So you'll end up with all the controllers zero, uh, numbers together, all the controller one numbers together, the uh, the array totals all together, and then we'll scroll down here and we'll see the virtual disk. So this virtual disk MD data one, I didn't have any activity against those for this performance capture, and then down here this uh, MD VM host LUN is where I was actually had the uh, the I/O load against during the during this performance run. So just as an example, let's pick the current IOs per second, select all of those for the virtual disk MDVM host, and then we're going to go to insert and select a line graph. And it'll plot the data. Now if we uh, right click on the graph and select select data, this will allow us to label by editing the series. We'll change it to IOs per second. And this will create a graph with one of the uh, columns on it. Now, if we want to add a second column, let's go ahead and do that. So, what we'll do is right click on the graph and select, select data again. And we're going to add a new series, and we're going to label it kilobits, kilobytes per second. And then select that column for the MDVM host LUN. Say OK. And then we'll be able to take a look at our graph and we'll see both uh, sets of data are now plotted. And the problem is that they're on totally different scales. So we really need to move the second one so that it uses a second horizontal axis to plot the data so that you can actually see both sets of data. So if we format the data series and say that it should be plotted on the secondary axis, axis you'll now be able to see both sets of data. Now let's add some titles to the vertical axis by selecting layout axis titles so on the primary vertical axis we will put a title for IOs per second and then on the second secondary vertical axis we'll get our kilobytes per second title. So now we've uh, used Excel 2007 to create a data, a graph of the MD3000i performance data. For other videos, check out DellTechCenter.com. Thank you.